Welcome students. Today in this video, I am going to discuss about the syllabus for preliminary written test for the recruitment to the post of Assistant Engineer Electrical under Public Works Department by West Bengal Public Service Commission. Generally, for all the Assistant Engineer recruitments by Public Service Commission is having the same syllabus. So before going into deep, that is before knowing the syllabus, we must know what is basically the examination means what is the type of the examination we are going to give so the structure of the examination as you can see here basically the scheme is with multiple choice questions means all the questions that will be asked are multiple choice in nature and how many questions will be there there will be 100 questions and you will be able to solve this question paper with a duration of two hours okay and definitely there will be negative marking and each of the questions will be having a mark of 2 that means the full mark will be 200 and you can see here that for each wrong answer the deduction in the mark will be two-third of the number allocated okay that means for performing three wrong answers two marks will be deducted okay so this is all about the scheme of the examination now we will go for the detailed syllabus which will help you to prepare for the examination so now you can see that this is the whole syllabus for the recruitment of assistant engineer electrical basically for West Bengal Engineering Services Electrical under Public Works Department. Also, the syllabus is same for recruitment of Assistant Engineer Electrical in Public Health Engineering Department or Department of Irrigation and Waterways Okay, or any other departments. As you can see here, Engineering Mechanics is the first chapter. Okay, so what are the topics? Alembert's Principle, Methods, of momentum, work, power, and energy, mass movement of inertia, rotation of rigid bodies, energy consideration. Okay, I am basically underlining those topics which are very much important regarding your examination. Okay, so you can see the next chapter is basically physics. This is basically basic physics which you have already studied in your 12th standard okay so here the topics are angular momentum and torque moment of inertia parallel and perpendicular axis theorem calculation of moment of inertia of some common solids like circular ring sphere etc rotational dynamics of a rigid body then very important newton's law of gravitation calculation of gravitational field and potential of a spherical distribution of mass motion under a central force kepler's law this is very important next relationships among different elastic constants okay bending moment very important cantilever problems elastic plastic and viscoelastic behavior of materials so in this case you may be knowing that there is a chapter in uh, engineering mechanics which is basically called strength of materials okay so that is very much important okay so these are the things you must study in your basic physics and basics of mechanical engineering then the third chapter is mathematics Okay, this mathematics basically including your class 12 mathematics and the engineering mathematics. Okay, so the review of limit, continuity and differentiability, successive differentiation, Rose theorem, mean value theorem, limit and continuity, Purcell derivatives, differentiations, Definition and properties, 
फंडामेंटल थियोरम ऑफ इंटीग्रल कैलकुलस मीन्स इंटीग्रेशन ओके सो दीज आर वेरी मच इंपॉर्टेंट एज आई एव मेड अंडर लाइन दट इज लिमिट इज वेरी मच इंपॉर्टेंट देन डिफरेंशिएशन एंड इंटीग्रेशन मीन्स डिफरेंशियल कैलकुलस एंड इंटीग्रल कैलकुलस नेक्स्ट चैप्टर इज Applied mechanics. Okay, so already I have said that there is a chapter engineering mechanics. This is basically extended part of that. That is applied mechanics. This corresponds to your engineering mechanics section, which is also having some common part in your basic physics. Okay. So I am not discussing this in detail as I will give the link for downloading this syllabus but there are very small questions generally comes from this chapter regarding the recruitment of assistant engineer electrical okay now it is coming electronics so in this electronic ports basically the pn junction diode is very important that is pn junction so all details are there that we basically study in basic electronics basic electronics also the part bjt means the bipolar junction transistor chapter is very much important and also some question may come from the operational amplifier chapter okay you will get the details here but these topics are most important from this chapter that is electronics as you have studied in your basic electronics okay you can go through the details from the whole syllabus that is downloadable from the link given in the comment section now we are coming to our electrical engineering part so most of the questions you will be getting from the upcoming chapters okay so the first chapter here is the circuit theory very important chapter in this chapter you will get questions related to ohms law kvl kcl power current voltage analysis or calculations like loop analysis or mesh analysis nodal analysis okay then two port network rl rc rlc series circuit parallel circuit all the things will be here and this is the most important chapter according to me the most important chapter why most important because almost almost 25% to 30% questions will be from this chapter okay next the the electrical engineering materials okay means the material used in construction of electrical wires electrical meshes magnetic materials all are basically coming within this chapter so this is an important chapter but percentage of question which will come from this chapter will be less it will be around 2 to 5% okay next see hydraulics and water power this is important with respect to mechanical engineering but uh, the question uh, corresponding to this chapter will be very much less so you may skip this next very important chapter electrical machines okay so here the chapter can be divided as dc generator and dc motor and next means dc machines and ac machines and in ac machines what will be there there will be alternator 
and synchronous motor and induction motor okay other than this non rotating machine that is transformer is there so full chapters that we have studied in our electrical engineering regarding transformers that is also included here both single phase transformers and there may be questions from the three phase transformers also auto transformer is included in this chapter so the full machine one and machine two that we have studied in our electrical engineering during btech that is coming inside the syllabus of a electrical recruitment for public works department or other government engineering departments okay next see the chapter is power planning and distribution so this is basically tdp means transmission and distribution of power this is also a very important chapter because 25 to 30 percent questions will be from this chapter like here 25 to 30 percent questions will be from this chapter okay so the power system that we have studied in our electrical engineering during btech means power system 1 and 2 is very much required for completing this chapter next the field theory within field theory we have to learn about electrostatics and electromagnetics so there may be 10 to 20% questions from this chapter but generally uh, it is less than 10% okay and the numerical analysis and computer programming is also included in the chapter but the number of question is generally very less okay next electrical power utilization this is a very important chapter because this is having the topic illumination which is very much important from the point of view of practical utilization of electrical energy uh, in case of public works as well as public health engineering and irrigation also so all these things like electrical welding uh, lighting and all other things which are included in this utilization chapter must be studied very carefully okay means there will be definitely five to six questions okay from this chapter okay next and the final one that is power system protection and switch gear okay in power system 2 in our btech basically we started switch gear and protection of protection system so that is also a part of the syllabus so you have to learn about different kinds of protection system like mcb and um, other circuit breakers lightning arresters and different kinds of relay systems motor protection transformer protections okay so these will be here in this chapter okay so from this chapter you will be able to get at least 6 to 7 questions okay so this is the syllabus so also study all the chapters which have been marked as very important so that you will be able to attempt most of the questions which are going to be asked in the upcoming examination so i think it is very much clear to all of you what is the whole syllabus for recruitment of assistant engineer electrical through public service commission in different departments of west bengal government mostly pwd phe and irrigation department so if you like the video kindly subscribe to the channel thank you thanks for watching